What's up guys? This is Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. Check us out, maplemotors.com. You can get financed and shipping information. Today we're going for a test drive in a 1980 model El Camino. This one here is up here at 11.9. We do got a 305 under the hood. AC, pretty smooth running motor. I like taking them down the road, point out any kind of flaws so you know exactly what you're buying when you get here. This one does have disc brakes in the front, drum in the rear, aftermarket set of wheels, pretty good tires. I mean, all around so far, I'm seeing this car, it looks nice and straight. The bed is super clean. Should be a great ride here. Check us out, maplemotors.com. Hit that subscribe button. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride, guys. Okay, before we take off here, we're gonna go ahead and look around the car. Go ahead and place your bets. Do you think the horn works? Uh, everybody wants to know what the car smells like now. So, uh, believe it or not, this one smells like a crayon. <laughs> That's not a bad smell. It smells pretty clean. Go ahead and start it up. It starts up nice and easy. I can show you the mileage here. It does, every time it turns over, it goes back to zero. So this one could be 100,635 100, what I'd say it is from the condition of the car. It's nice. Um, looking at all our gauges, looks like our oil pressure gauge is working. The engine temp is coming up. Gas gauge is working, volts. And there's our clock out. I think our clock's out. Oh my goodness, did you see it? The clock is now working. Well, I said that. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> all right, radio? We're jamming, AC? Compressor's on. Compressor's on. I wonder if it's gonna blow though. It's not actually blowing out the vents here. It's coming out the dash. And it's already cold outside. So cold air is just blowing out of here. But I guess since the engine temperature is uh, already up, the AC should be working fine. Horn, ready? We got a loud one, guys. Wipers? Oh yeah squirters and everything did you see that i didn't even hit that it just started squirting you turn the wipers on they just start squirting apparently i pulled out on the switch i must have hit inward now look i gotta get a chamois goodness let's take off let's keep my seat belt on all right what i like to do is go down the road point out all the flaws that way you know what you're getting before you come down here we do this with every car on the lot all right. So far, so good on this one. It looks nice and clean on the outside. I'm gonna be doing a walk around video halfway through this test drive over in a little parking lot, wherever I can find that's empty and I'll make it happen. Um, other than that, we're about to roll out and we got a wide open road here. Speedometer's coming up. Engine temp's already up, so. We're going straight as an arrow right now, guys. It's not pulling to the left or right. As soon as I turn, it turns nice and tight. Oh, give me a kick down. Let's try the brakes. The brakes feel good. Let's see if this kick down's hooked up. Little gas, little gas. Floor. if that kick down was hooked up or not. I couldn't feel it. It doesn't feel like it's engaging. Oh man, we're going to have to stop over here. Tell you what. Turn signal's popping up on the dash here. I got to stop over here. The guy's down the road. Newton Auto Sales is what the dealership's called. And I want you to check this out. We're going to cut to a different scene. Uh, so far, so good on this El Camino. We're going to get right back to it here in a second. If you want to see what I'm about to pull up to, go to the end of the video or watch all the way to the end. And uh, we'll make it happen. Wait till y'all see that. All you got to do is go to the end of the video. Just watch the whole video and you'll be able to see it. Um, we're going to jump out of here. He had a bunch of Corvettes out front and stuff. I had to stop. I was like, man, this guy's always got some good stuff on his lot. So the carburetor flooded out a little bit. That's something else. 
another good good point to stop in here cut it off for about 10 minutes come back see how it starts um you got to give it some gas when you start it back so carburetor was flooding out a little bit we'll take off from here I'm sure y'all seen those vents in the corner of your eye there. Traffic's getting thick. May end up just doing this car and letting them uh and doing the rest of them in the morning I, I usually don't like getting out when there's so much traffic it's it makes for a slow paced video this one does have a tilt column in it no lights on the dash thing I've noticed is the seat belt keeps getting loose on me. gonna pull over in the parking lot here get us some outside walk around footage and keep rolling oh we got somebody parked up in our spot well you know what we go to the old spot i don't know if y'all know how close we are to the old spot going over this way get this footage all right guys Okay, just got done doing the walk around video. Uh, getting ready to take off out of here. Head on over to the place I like to call the War Palace, which is our warehouse. And see if I got a wheel that I want to put on my truck. So, got a two birds with one stone deal. So far, so good though. Engine temperature's at 210. Have been circling around the parking lot. And I did notice the idle was a little bit high. Kind of turn it down a little bit. That would probably help out a lot. Try to sit out of the view of the sun here. Now 
There we go. It's a good cruiser. You could probably drive this car daily. Once I leave the warehouse, we'll come on back through. Um, we'll hit my little cut through road, which every day more and more people always go through there for some reason. Kind of wonder if they're watching the videos. They're like, oh, hey, that road does exist. <laughs> All right, guys, I'll be back in just a moment. All right, got that wheel set off in there. We gonna head on back. Let's go do it guys. Go ahead, wait a second. Let this guy roll on. So this road here's got the speed bump in it. Gonna hit it at a moderate speed. Coming up right here. Nice and smooth. Lots of traffic, lots of traffic. I'll see y'all here in just a moment. I appreciate y'all riding along with me. We'll be up at the lot here in a minute. Hey, if you have any other questions, visit maplemotors.com. We got close to 100 detailed photos of this ride and every ride on the car lot. You can see all of our inventory we updated every Monday. We have shipping and financing available for every car out here. If you don't mind, hit that subscribe button. I post videos every day, and I do appreciate y'all sharing them and watching them. Thanks again, guys. I'll see y'all later.